and to Kojak. <laughs> we love you from the Greenberry Sparky Band. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Please welcome to the field, the Green Marys Marching Band! <laughs> the band is under the direction of Jim Alder, assisted by Brian Carr, Bert Briggs, and Tasha Alder. The drum majors are Allie Vandal and Kaya Barr. Their show is entitled The Green Bar Ghost. Musical selections include The Green Bar Ghost, Food Criminals, Sweet dreams are made of this, and for whom the bell tolls. Are the judges ready? <laughs> Drum majors, Ali Vandal and Kaya Bar, is your band ready? Do you believe in ghosts? Well, you might or you might not, but in these hills, a ghost once helped convict a murderer. This is the true account of the Greenbrier ghost. Our story begins in the fall of 1896 when a young woman by the name of Zona Heaster fell in love with the mysterious and handsome new blacksmith in town, Edward Trout Shee. Zona and Trout's new life together started off well enough, but winters in these parts can be hard for a young couple in those days. Zona was left at 
home to keep up the farm while Trout headed out each morning to make a living at Crookshank's blacksmith shop. It wouldn't be long before things took a dark turn for the shoes. As the days passed, Zona's mother got an uneasy feeling that Trout Shoe might be responsible for her daughter's death, and she prayed for Zona's ghost to reveal the truth about faith and life. With only circumstantial evidence and the testimony of a ghost, Prosecutor John Preston started the wheels of justice, moving toward one of the strangest and most fantastic murder trials ever. <laughs> Stand 
of first degree murder. We the jury find you 